Hi everyone, I'm Stephanie Keener, the PA here at Moksha Derm, and with Melanoma May coming up, I thought today would be a great time to start talking about what to look out for as far as melanomas. Most of you have heard about the ABCDEs, so I just wanted to reiterate those. When you're looking at your skin, these are the things that you really need to be paying attention to. So we start with A, which is asymmetry. So if you see a mole or a lesion on your skin that has um, some asymmetry to it, it's not you know more circular or ovular, you wanna have that looked at. B is borders, so if you see irregular borders, they can look kind of chunky or ill-defined. C is color, so you're looking for multiple colors, um, brown, black, sometimes you'll see some blue, maybe some white or some red, that's something to look out for. D is for diameter. Anything larger than six millimeters, which is basically the size of a pencil eraser, is sometimes concerning. And then we have E, which is elevated or evolving. So if you see changes to a, an already existing mole or lesion, that's something that you want to definitely have checked out sooner rather than later. One thing to keep in mind, too, is that most melanomas actually are found in areas of skin that previously did not have any kind of molar lesion on it. So you need to make sure you're checking not only your existing moles, but also any new spots. Uh, a great way to do that is a monthly self-skin exam. And then of course, make sure you're coming in every year for your annual full body skin exam here at Moksha Derm.